Okay, we are almost ready. Adjusting chat boxes, always fun. Okay, looking good. All right, put the chat box. And and minimize. Okay, we are officially good. All right, hello, my fellow ninjas. Hope you guys are doing good. Hope you're healthy and safe. We're back with some more Pokemon Pool Adventures. It's been a while. I've missed this game, and of course, whenever I get the chance to stream, I will do so. So, yeah, I'm happy to be back. Last time we accomplished a lot. We basically did some off-screen Pokemon trainer farming. Basically, I went the other way, so now I officially beat all the Pokemon trainers on the way to Pistoria City. So that's taken care of. Uh, it was in this area. Right here, the remainder of this part right here I finished. So officially we beat all the Pokemon trainers to both routes. So now after we beat Story City Gym, we should go back to Hearth Home or we may actually get the path clear to Celestic Town. One of the two, but either way Hearth Home City Gym is next and that is going to be something. So at the end of that, our Pokemon are now looking like this. Gastrodon got to 32, Monferno level 32, Luxray at 30, Saravia 30, Kadabra close to 32. Now of course this Kadabra has a spell type of a grass type move, we're basically gonna, you know, use that along with Shockwave, finish the level up and then let Luxray have some fun. So that is the plan for this one. Let's go and hope we're not under level. Oh my god, I actually forgot about this gym. Gym leader Wake, uh, I mean, Crasher Wake, is a master of water type Pokemon. I'd say you've got guts if you try to face down water types with fire or ground type Pokemon. But that part I'll leave up to you. Go and have some good battles. Well, thank you, good sir. You are too kind. Right. This gym was one of my favorites because of the uh, technique that you had to do where the water level rises and falls so that you can progress further. Reminds me of how it used to be in, po in Legend of Zelda games. Hopefully walking through this gym is not going to be laggy. If not, I'll run. Alright. First switch. But first, first trainer. My body isn't the only thing I work on toughening up here. I also work on my Pokemon and my spirit. Well, good for you. <laughs> oh, I thought it was a little girl. Excuse me. And it's an adorable weasel, level 26. I like it. Let's see how much. I think Grass Knot should do a good amount of damage considering it's Kadabra. So even if it weighs not so much, it'll still pretty much do that. I want to save Shockwave. Look at that experience. 417. Wow, trainer, you just might be tougher than our gym leader. 104. What? Oh my god, that was not a lot of money. Yeah, water level's gonna have to go up, because otherwise we won't be able to proceed. So this has to go like that. Oh, sure, why not? Let's let's go down here and see who else we gotta beat before we rise the water level again. All right, you are the next challenger. And rise! And then comes that switch over there. Okay. Hello, fisherman. 
I have mastery over the incredible power of water. You won't win. Well. Walter is very confident. Luckily, Barboge is highly, highly weak against grass type moves. Perks of water ground types. <laughs> Bye-bye! Have fun with your mastery of water type. <laughs> Ooh, now we're talking. Get that experience, Kadabra. But the kid wins anyway. I'm just bowled over. <laughs> now that was more money. Okay. I have to get to the blue switch. To get to the blue switch, I gotta find my way down. Mm. But I have access here now. Okay, so yeah, we're good. Blue switch over here, we're good. Because we need to rise the water level again. I've traveled all over the globe while raising Pokemon. This is the gym I've chosen. You'll find it a handful for sure. Oh, it's pretty fun. Damien! Ooh, Wingle! Oh my god, adorable. Oh, it's so cute! Epic stands! I love it. Have a shockwave. I admire you that much. <laughs> I have missed playing this game. I love it. Damn, if only you gave more experience. Trying to level up here. But so far, I am pleased with the enemy levels. Gives me confidence that maybe the gym leader's Pokemon may also be level 32, if not 33, 34 tops. Which is pretty close to my level anyway. I don't mind. I wasn't able to level up further anyway in this area. You! You're a kind of top class tough! Well, thank you! Recognized. So now we can make our way back here. And then go here and continue over here. I want to become a strong trainer like Crasher Wake. Caitlyn uses Azuril. Nice. Let's test Grass Knot with you. Ah, right. Water normal. But critical hit though, that's pretty good. Ooh, the luck. Get shockwave on you. Bye bye. Level up, level up, level up. Woo! Level up. <laughs> awesome. Plus four special attack. Let's go. Look at that special attack. Nasty. Drone, you're too much. <laughs> Thank you. Not the last trainer to say that to me. Alright, Luxray, you are next, my friend. I've landed the most fish Pokemon in the world. I'm next. Oh, <laughs> the most fish Pokemon in the world? Do you have six? No, that's three. Okay. Level 22. 
my goodness. Oh, Luxray was super close to 31. That's interesting. Should be leveling up right now. Yep, definitely. Nice. Barboach. Oh, I'm gonna have to use Hidden Power. For Luxray, Hidden Power is still a Grass-type move. But for a different Pokémon, it changes. Hmm. Eh, it'll do. Uh-oh. You can hold it, you're fine. There you go. Ah, oh, so close. Well, my spark is gonna be weaker now for the next Pokemon. Oh, and conveniently it's weaker for Gyarados. <laughs> oh boy. Let's give it a try. <laughs> and on top of that, it has intimidated, so yeah, Spark may not do much damage. <laughs> Let, let's see. <laughs> Probably not even half health. Ooh, a critical hit! Wait, wait, what? Super, what? Oh, okay. Wow. So much for the debuffs. <laughs> it didn't do anything. Being number one in the world doesn't mean a thing. Nope. That was a surprise. Oop, wrong button. Oh, I'm shocked. But happy. <laughs> All right, we're gonna have to lower the water level again, just so we can make it past this part. Oh, it's a little glitchy here. Okay, it has to sink a little bit. There. Now we can go down here for the final part. There we go. Last Pokemon trainer. And then Chim Weaver. Like the raging sea, I crash down and wash away everything before me. That's just how I roll. I'd like to see you try. Samson. Oh, Shallows. I just remembered last stream I caught a shiny Shallows. I was very tempted to raise it. And replace my current shallows. <laughs> well, Gastrodon now. <laughs> Almost 32. It's probably one of those trainers that has three of the same Pokemon, I'm assuming. Based off of what I've seen so far. <laughs> Wingle! Just use Kadabra for the gym leader. <laughs> that wave didn't even wash my hands. <laughs> Woohoo! Here we go. Four 
14 hours and 13 minutes of total game time. Now before we start, one thing I will check first. Just making sure things are running good. Yep. Alright, good. Alright, here we go. Welcome. I don't get challenged very often. <laughs> Legendary Voodoo. Hello. The glory you are now beholding is the Prestoria Gym Leader. That's right. I'm Crasher Wake. My Pokemon were toughened up by stormy white waters. They'll take everything you can throw at them and then pull you under. Victory will be ours. Come on, let's get it done. How are you today? Well, tonight. Look at him, he's ready for a bear hug. Oh boy. 27! I feel very confident about this. Eh, I don't need attack points, I'm fine. <laughs> Special attack for the win. You better defeat it. Good girl. I almost said good boy, then I was like, wait, Kadabra's a female. Gotta get it right. Floatzel. I'm curious to see how much grass knot damage is gonna it's gonna take. 30! Oh my gosh! Oh. It does have a good amount of speed. Hey. I am totally not under level for this gym either. Awesome. I trained just enough. <laughs> uh, almost. That was pretty good though. Pretty good. Kadabra with Grass Knot does pretty good damage. Finish it. Now he gets two shockwaves. I'm doing good. Happy that I'm able to stream right now. Take it down. Oh my. Tankiness. Okay, have another one. Uh oh, it's a it's a physical water attack. Hold on! Okay, you're fine. <laughs> but that was a little squishy. <laughs> but you know, it balances out if you think about it, because Kadabra has nasty special attack damage. My goodness. Now since we're playing Pokemon Pearl, what is your favorite song? If you asked me that question, I would say all of them. Because <laughs> I can't pick. Hey, that there. That was a good move. Grass Knot. Kadabra may get taken out here. If Grass Knot does not take it out, beautiful. 33! We're good! We're ready for the next gym. Where we are gonna be very underleveled by 6, uh, 3 levels. If I remember correctly. Oh! It's gone and ended! How will I say this? I want more! I wanted to battle- God damn it, that was too fast. I'm assuming he said I wanted more. It seems the undertow pulled me under. But I had a great time battling with you. You've earned this. Woohoo! I'm fist pumping the air right now, nobody can see. I gotta get rid of that notification when I'm playing Pokemon. You need that Fen badge to use the hidden move Defog outside of battle. I already have it, awesome. This is a special reward from me in recognition of your team's power. TM55! It contains brine, I think. Yep, it inflicts double the damage on the targets with less than half their HP left. Ooh, interesting. Use it to end battles decisively. Mm hmm, I love them. I got to play Platinum only one time, but it was pretty epic. They're good, I love them. I, my favorite 
Pokemon antagonist song is in this game. Cyrus has the best antagonist song. And then uh, Team Ru uh, Team Magma or Team Aqua's... Uh, uh, what, was, what was his name again? Archie and Maxi also were my favorites before that. Pretty fun and pr pretty good Elite Four songs. And one of my favorite champion songs. Cynthia is just badass. <laughs> we did it! And it's nighttime. Okay, we're running through the city because, you know, avoiding tiny bits of lag. Potato. Woo! Alright, now we're gonna have to fly back and see if the road to Celestic Town has been cleared. If not, then we're going straight to Heart Home City Gym, where we are going to be very underleveled. Fun time. Ghost Gym awaits. Alright, Staravia, you're next. Woo! Mm -hmm. It's the best. That one, for sure, I would say has my favorite songs for everything. Favorite antagonist song, good Elite Four music, good Elite Four champion music, everything. Every fucking song in that game is amazing. Love it. I finished the playthrough of it right before I started this one, actually. It was fun. Hi, Renee, how are you? We just finished beating uh, our fourth gym. Let me confirm. I think this is the fourth gym. Yep. So now we gotta go straight to Heart Home City. How are you? Oh wait, before we go, I was supposed to... Huh. Was this the one? Haha! <laughs> the package finally came from the Valstone Warehouse. So, now it's my job to deliver this to the lake. This is an important mission. No failure allowed. No making boo-boos like wandering off into the Great Marsh. You were eavesdropping. I was just loudly talking to myself. If I wasn't in a hurry, I'd pulverize you with my Pokemon. But I have to get on my way to the lake ASAP. So you're lucky. I'm out. Oh, and listen up, you. Don't you dare follow me. Yep, we can't leave just yet. <laughs> Wait, unless when I leave, it's gonna blow up. I'm doing good. Hugs to you too and everybody else in chat. Oh, he's stuck? Quick! Persistent pest! If our plan works, our boss's dream comes closer to fruition. Our boss's ideal world is going to be created. So, I'm not going to waste my time on a nobody like you. I'm telling you now, don't you come chasing after me. D-D-Druk! <sighs> Interruptions. Whoops! <laughs> I'm not always going to plow into you every time we meet. So how's it going, Liz? Buffing up your Pokemon, eh? I'll test you and your Pokemon out to see how buff and tough you are. Of course you will. God damn it, I forgot about this battle. I'm gonna kick your butt for interrupting me. I'm doing good. Oh look, Starly versus Staravia. Meet your future self. <laughs> Oh, jeez. Hmm. Let me have some fun using fly. <laughs> that tickles. Do it again. <laughs> Renee, did you enjoy playing Pokemon Pearl or Diamond or Platinum? Bye! Have a beautiful time! Give me that experience, thank you. Ponyta! Sure, why not? I don't have to change. I want to get the experience to level up. If I have to, have to, I will switch. Fly away, birdie! Be free! 
And also, don't get me started on the, the new Pokemon visual attacks. It's awesome. The attack moves are amazing. The new attacks are amazing. You go, boy! Kick his ass! Damn! Uh, if I remember correctly, Friend Club is still water type, but has Metal Claw. So I can keep Staravia on the field. I've had Empoleon only one time. The other two times I played this game I had Infernape, but I think I remember it wasn't Steel just yet. It's after becoming Empoleon. Mm-hmm, they're awesome. I was only ever able to play until black and white, and then after that my potato laptop was like, no. Bubble beam. Hang on, birdie! <laughs> hold on! I, 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 Jesus Christ, hold on. My goodness. Don't miss. <laughs> It'll be awkward. But yeah, because um, for my actual Nintendo DS, I had all these Pokemon games. And the last one we had was black and white. And then after that, hard gold, so silver. And then that was it. So eventually, I'll probably get myself a 3DS to try to play the other ones. I'll try to catch up to the other ones though, for sure. Saravia, I believe you can finish beating him. Yeah, I can tell you raised your Pokemon to be tough. Alright, finish it, Staravia. <laughs> Apologies for the extra... Ooh! Extra beeping noises, because... Staravia is injured. Get him, get him, get him! Good, we're good! I gotta go back to the Pokemon Center. What just happened? You're telling me I lost? Yes. Heh, <laughs> yeah. Maybe you did get a bit tougher since last time. That even shocked me a bit, so yeah. I got beat because I was careless. So hey, what was that Team Galactic guy all freaking out about? I don't know what he's up to, but you should chase him down. If you're not a Pokemon and you run like that, you're a bad guy. Alright, Liz, next time, I'm not holding back. You're running in the same direction! Why don't you go? I gotta do everything myself. Back to the Pokemon Center. Yes! <laughs> Wait, Generation 5 was black and white, right? Just to make sure I don't have them mixed up. <laughs> Let's investigate the lake at night. Yes, then definitely yes. I loved Pokemon Black and White so much. The Elite Four was my favorite thing. <laughs> the Elite Four music was so epic. I'm fine. I'm not fangirling. You can't hear that in my voice. I have perfect camouflage. I'm calm. But yeah, I loved the Elite Four. I loved Team Plasma's music. I loved Team Plasma in general. Wait, do... I guess I can go this way. I did beat everybody. It's not, a, it's not much of a run. Oh, here he is! But yeah, the Elite Four, amazing, the music, amazing, and the way the Elite Four functioned was my favorite thing. The fact that they all are each other's weaknesses, and no matter which one you pick, it doesn't fucking matter. Like, they will kick your ass if you're not careful. It was amazing. I loved it. We needed the energy from the Valley of Windworks to make this. It would take a scientific genius to make something like this. Therefore, our boss, who made this, is a scientific genius! Grah! You were eavesdropping! I was just thinking out loud! 
You're a persistent pest. I'm getting tired of running away. I'm not going to waste my energy knocking you around. It was amazing. It's my favorite. And the other favorite music in black and white was the famous Gary music when you go into the Battle Tower, I believe. The remake of the, the Gary theme song from Pokemon Yellow was amazing. Loved it. <sighs> Why am I running like this anyway? That new universe the boss was talking about is giving me goosebumps thinking about it. So, we use this. Bah! You were eavesdropping! I was only talking to myself. You're persistent too. I'm pooped out from all the running. But I'm not going to battle you. He's all tired. <laughs> Yeah, Cyrus is amazing. And now he's tired. Oh no, you're still on my tail. The lake's within sight. You leave me no choice. My Pokemon will KO you. Finally, he accepts my challenge because I tired him out. <laughs> so that means he won't perform properly. Play Meow! Kick its butt. Bob, Bob. And then there's Pokemon Heart Gold and Soul Silver, where they've done everything right. <laughs> and I, the, my favorite thing was the fact that your top Pokemon can walk outside of the Pokeball. So cute! I was so happy. If I didn't run, I could have battled harder. Yes. I can't battle anymore. I'm running on fumes. I'll have to give this to the commander. I wish I got to use it at the lake. <laughs> He's just walking. The poor man. Cynthia with her cute little earrings. Isn't she adorable? Look at her. Oh, hello. Long time no see. How is your Pokedex filling up? I came to research the folklore about the lake, but... Well, it doesn't appear as if the lake is open to the public now. Have you heard the folklore about it? They say there is an island inside the lake. And inside that island is a mirage of a Pokemon. No one must enter the chamber of that Pokemon. Sorry to change the subject, but have you seen a group of side up? Yes! Celestic Town is now open! I can train my Pokemon before going to the gym! Woo! Uh, <clears throat> group of side up on Route 210? Yes. Yes, that's right. By the, by the cafe on Route 210. You've seen that group of side up huddled with their heads in their uh, hands? Anyway, what you should do is use this medicine on the side up. You're working on a Pokedex, so it would be worthwhile for you. Secret Potion! I went on a big adventure with a Pokedex when I was younger. I hope you get to meet every kind of Pokemon there is to see. It may help you with the secret of the Mirage Pokemon. See you later! I like how in both games you end up meeting the champion and they help you out. And then, surprise! Well, at some point, this lake is gonna explode, and we're gonna hear about it on the news or something. Alright, so now we get to fly. Our work here is done. We're gonna go back to Silesian Town, and then make our way to Celestic Town. And we're gonna heal. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. 
Ah, when you press the button too much. Up I go, so I can avoid all the major lag when I walk across the city. It's still in effect? Wow. Oh, seriously? <laughs> oh my god. Bye, people. Hi, Psyduck. The Psyduck are standing firm. They aren't inclined to move. Would you like to use Seek a Potion? Yeah. The Psyduck appear to be cured of their chronic headache. Bye. Clear the path for me, thank you. Aw, they're so cute. <laughs> I don't know. Ah, oh, the cuteness. Oh, there she is. I was wondering why I couldn't walk. Oh, good. You used the secret potion I gave you. Psyduck are known to suffer from chronic headaches. But no one's been able to figure out what triggers the headaches. Oh, yes. Can I ask you a big favor? I want you to deliver this old charm to my grandma in Celestic Town. Yes, I am planning on doing that as soon as I finish playing all the ones that I can run on my potato laptop. Because it would be pretty funny to randomize it and do like some of the things like Nuzlocke and stuff. Just to see. I know there are some rare Pokemon between here and Celestic Town, so it'll be worth your while to go. Mm -hmm. I'm up for doing that, for sure, seeing if I can succeed. I'm no stranger to challenges as a player of Dark Souls and Bloodborne and Neo. I have done new Game Plus 7 challenge runs. I can do this. <laughs> My grandma has this sort of bossy atmosphere about her. I think you'll recognize her right away. Yes, I'm sure you will. She's the Elder of Celestic Town. And the location... Look on your town map. You can't miss it. Okay, I'm counting on you. See you again down the road. Yeah, I'll definitely for sure give it a try and see how it goes. Uh, Alright, so now we can continue going up. Ooh! Ooh, a Pokeball! Super Repel. Run, run, run! Escape the lag! Oh, I see those people. I see you hiding in that glass. Ooh, Pokeball! Ooh! Good stuff. Hello. I am one of the Ninja Trio. Being discovered means I must battle. Alright, Ninja Trio. I have spotted the other two. Oh, Joe, dude. Well, it's a good thing I have Steel Wing. I used to have this funny luck with Staravia where every time I had Staravia on the field, there would always be Geodudes. It's kind of funny. Steal it. Will do! I mean, it'll definitely be way after I finish um, this one and if, the, if Pokemon Black or White let me stream it or record it, and then after that Heart Gold, and then after that, Pokemon Emerald. Um, then <laughs> I'll be starting it, so it, it's a ways from now. I'll just I'll remember it for sure because it was on my mind to try out just in case. But yeah, for sure, I am definitely down for challenging stuff when it comes to games. Mhm. Mm no. You, uh, oh. Oh no. No, not that attack. Survive. You have so much to live for. Oh my god. One HP. Well, that was convincing enough what they said. <laughs> you have so much to live for. Oh god. You know what? I'm gonna risk it for the biscuit. No, 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 no. I, 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 I can't. I can't. We're gonna use Hyper Potion first. <laughs> I 
Oh, are you kidding me? I will never get stuck in that game. <laughs> that generation was the best. I played it so much back when it came out. But yeah, for sure, I'll, I will. It'll be a smooth ride. Because I think most of everything stayed the same, but there were some changes. But yeah, it'll be fine. If I do, I'll definitely let you know. Oh boy. We're in this predicament again. But we got this. <gasps> no! The shame! We almost had it. Level 32! Birdie, why? Alright. Okay, do I have revive? I can just revive and then she'll still get the experience. It missed. I'm so sad. <laughs> Have fun trying to... Critical hit! I was gonna talk smack and you do that? Rude! Die! Jesus Christ! I was gonna say have fun trying to use rollout against my tankiest Pokemon. And then it's like... Fucking... Jeez! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> My goodness! I concede defeat. You better concede defeat. My goodness, the shock in that Pokemon battle. Alright, Gastrodon, you're okay. Alright, time for Monferno to have some fun. It is your turn to battle. Oh yeah, I gotta teach somebody Brine, but I think Brine is a physical move, but I think Gastrodon should be fine considering the nature that I picked for it, where it keeps its attack and also pretty close to its special attack, while also being tanky. Yeah, it can work. It has Dig. And Body Slam. Let me take a look. I'll teach them these later. 65. Oh, Brian is not a physical spell. I mean, spell. Uh, 65. I thought it was, for some reason, a physical attack move. Does it do more damage than Water Pulse? Because that'd be cool. 60. Alright. You will now replace, because it has a pretty good effect, but it only has 10 usage. Hmm, I can live with it. I have some berries. Yeah, it, it, it should be fine. It has a pretty good effect. Alright, Water Pulse. It's been real. Discovered means I must battle. Oh, they all said the same thing. <laughs> Alright, what do you have, Brennan? Zubat! Alright. 25, not bad. I'm happy that I'm doing really good on the level training so far. Have a rock tomb, just don't miss. Good boy. Bye bye. A Pokemon I hate the most, Zubat, and its entire evolution. Scorupi, adorable. What the fuck is your? Uh, I think it's. Uh, wait. Trying to check something. Oh, 
Give me a second. I will be right back. Don't go anywhere. fun asking for a certain bag of chips and then you get another one instead. Great! But it's one that I like at least. Uh, yeah, Crobat is, is cool. We, we cool with Crobat. It's uh, the other two that are annoying. Right, 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 right. I'm trying to remember the nature of this thing. Um, this, this is dark bug or something. Dark poison or some shit like that. It was really weak towards ground types, I remember, because of the, the Elite Four. Oh. Oh! It's only bug right now. And then later becomes bug. I actually don't remember. I don't, I don't remember. But something like that. So it's... Right now, it's still a bug, but when it evolves, it becomes dark poison or dark bug. I think it was dark poison. Hmm. Hello. I am one of the ninja. Oh, wait. But how did you discover me? Don't tell me you're a ninja, too. <gasps> You've discovered my secret. Stunky, alright. Oh, I don't have any ground type moves, so you're gonna have to deal with Flame Wheel. Not bad. Ooh, burned! Nice! But yeah, mainly because Supersonic was always the move they would use and it annoyed the crap out of me. <laughs> Out of that section. Anything in here? Ah, I knew it. Well, Ultra Ball. The fog. I mean, do I really need to learn the fog when I can still see? But I think the fog becomes worse. So you know what? I'm gonna see if Bidoof can learn this. Flying type move? Well, shit. Alright, Staravia, you're. Uh... No, 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 no. Do I, do I need this? To... I, I can see. Uh, well, I can kind of see right now. I can see. I don't want to waste a freaking spot. Okay, there's a, there's a trainer here. 
there's a person here. We're gonna fight everybody. We need it. I just startled you. When you're still struggling to recover, I'll already be the winner. <laughs> what logic is that? I appreciate your efforts, kid, but no. <laughs> oh, speaking of Zubat, <laughs> let's hope Rock Tomb does not miss. Oh, that's why I had to use Defog. It'll make me miss. Okay, Flame Wheel it is. I don't want it to increase the chances of me missing Rock Tomb even more. There you go. Yeah, I, I'm, I guess I'm gonna have to use it for now. And then later on delete that move. Sadly, I'm gonna have to get rid of Aerial Ace. Don't miss. Oh. Here we go. What? A miracle! It didn't use Supersonic! <laughs> or Confuse Ray. Whoa! The shock. Oh no. And you can see just fine through that? Come on. I'm gonna have to use it. Oh jeez, really? Come on, Inferno, I'm gonna need you to focus here. Thank you. Yeah, I'm gonna have to get rid of it. I forgot Defog does that. Yeah, it, it, it's bad for me, because I need my attacks not to miss three turns in a row. <laughs> it is annoying. And it's a goal bat! Yeah, I'm gonna have to use it. Because <laughs> otherwise the Pokemon battles are gonna last much longer. It'll suck. Thank you! <laughs> it's a miracle! You better die. <sighs> Rock Tomb is a weaker attack, I need to remember that. It's not Rock Throw. Mm. You can hold it, don't be... Okay. I have to not miss this. I believe you. I mean, in you. There you go. Yeah, at certain levels, Rock Tomb becomes kind of like a... weak or a rock attack. Woo! 33! Yay! Alright, one more Pokemon. Let's go Ruby. Okay, I can heal. Oh my god, it's adorable. It's Pokemon Mist. Finally. Alright, one more flame wheel. There you go. Bye bye. Close to 34. Oh, what's that? You're supposed to be fumbling more. Nope. Alright, Staravia, I have no choice. It's either that or long Pokemon fights. <laughs> Alright, Aerial 8. Well, actually, I can get rid of Roost. I mean... Yeah, I'll get rid of Roost. I can still keep Aerial Ace. Why not? Let's do it. Clear the path. Woohoo! Back to normal! Wait, you can't see me? Really? Oh, if I could use the hidden move Defog, I'd clear up the weather. Defog? A bird Pokemon flap. Oh, a bird Pokemon flap their wings to blow the fog away. 
Alright. Bull Trainer! As an ace trainer, I have to take battles in stride. I need to stay cool and calm whether I win or lose. <laughs> Watch her freak out when I beat her. And then she's like, oh no! Well, let's punch the pony. I don't want to do it, but you know. It's either the pony goes or the monkey goes. Now, give me a good amount of XP. Beautiful. Pretty good. Grottle! Oh, Grotile! Wait, Grottle. Oh, I forgot how cute you look! <laughs> oh, it's so cute! <laughs> Kill Pony, <laughs> return to Monkey. I expected you to survive that, considering you're a ground type now. That's not gonna do anything. Bye, turtle! Now, I'm hoping I get 1000 experience from that Pokemon. Oh, okay, 800 works. Okay, close to 34! Ay, I lost! I knew she'd freak out. Oh god, it's a double battle. Whichever one I get on, they're both gonna look at me anyway. Now, Jen, watch this! I'm going to use everything you've taught me. Here comes the trainer! Zack, you ready? Let's do this! I wanted to pick one of them only, because then I get shared experience. But, oh well. Ooh! Gyarados and Raichu! Epic! I kinda have the right Pokemon for this occasion. Uh, our attack is half though. Okay. Let's punch Raichu and use Spark on Gyarados. Woohoo! Critical hit! Couldn't have gotten better. Level up? Almost. Beautiful. Success. Wow, someone that's even better than Jen! I just got embarrassed in front of my little buddy here! <laughs> wow, that's a good amount of money. Thank you, come again. Alright, next up... Using Gastrodon first because I need to break that bad luck I have where every time I leave Gastrodon almost last, I always go against water types. You know how boring that is? Water against water. I haven't saved in a while. <laughs> it's a very slow battle when you go water with water. Wow, you're fast! You seem to have a lot of confidence. Let's see if it's justified. Well, allow me to justify. Ernest. Mothin. Beautiful. 
Oh, it's better than a water type, but usually I either get Rosalia's or water type trainers. So I'll, I'll take this. Now Brian can finish it off because the Pokemon is missing half HP, so it'll be KO. Bye. Goodbye. Nice. Onyx, beautiful. I am against the right trainer. I'm gonna keep Gastrodon second at all times. <laughs> Ow. You know, I'm embarrassed to say that after watching the, a good while of watching Pokemon, growing up watching Pokemon, and playing a lot of Pokemon games, it didn't occur to me until Pokemon Pearl that Onyx was a snake. I am so sad I didn't figure that out sooner, but then again I never paid attention to Onyx. But I never fucking noticed it was a snake. <laughs> it's very sad. I'm a Pokemon lover and yet I don't even fucking notice it's a snake. Sadness. Boop. Yep. I have not noticed. I probably noticed that like maybe within the last five years, six years or so, that Onyx was actually a snake. Haha, <laughs> a total loss for me. Sadness. Probably because it's so huge and it doesn't look like a snake. It just looks like an intimidating rock monster. over here. Pokeball? I see you, hidden trainer. Eh. Boop. A ninja can use all sorts of cool techniques. <laughs> like going invisible. Davido uses dust talks. Okay. I'll be using my brine combo. I have got to grab that item they gave me where my slow Pokemon gets to attack first, always. I don't know, I don't remember where I put that thing, but it's somewhere. Because it's a slug, so it, it's supposed to be very slow. Makes sense. Woo, level up! Techniques fail to work. Just taking a peek at what's over here before I go back to the other side. Ah. Okay, so the other route is the way to go. I'm gonna have to remember there's a Pokeball down there. <gasps> Shadow Ball! And I'm going against the Ghost Gym! that eh. Fuck yeah! 80! Let's go! Gimme! I'm getting rid of recover, I don't need it. I have hyper potions for that. Woo! A well-balanced Kadabra with so many advantage moves. It's got a move for everything. <laughs> Oh, man. Shadow Ball. Exploration for the win. Whee! Hello. More Pokeball down there. This buff physique isn't just for show. Adam uses Matchoak, of course. The cute muscle lizard. Hmm. Uh, 
Aw, close. Oh. Oh. Uh oh. You're tanky, you can hold it. Oh my god. Don't do that again. <gasps> Ooh, you can hold it. Show your tankiness. There you go. Ooh, close. Bye bye. Ooh, 906 experience. I have to go to the shop. <laughs> Ninjas appear where you least expect us, but I am expecting you. I can see through your techniques because I myself am a ninja. Dig should do the trick. Oh god, it's a gold bat. Ugh, I'm gonna body slam that bat. Oh, Jesus, no. <laughs> it begins. Ugh. Oh, thank you. Kick its ass. Perfect for Brian and paralyzed. Serves you right. Now attack. Good! Good! Get wrecked, bitch! Fuck your confusion. Snapped out. Nice. I didn't expect to lose. Yep. Give me that Pokeball. Oh, it's a smoke ball. Oh, now it's dark. It's officially nighttime in the game. Even though it's been nighttime for a while now for me. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. I'll teach you about the charms of bird Pokemon. As long as you don't use charm or attract, I'm okay with it. Rihanna and a Hoot Hoot. 27, okay. Don't use hypnosis, please. I've noticed you do that. I don't like it. Ooh! Get smacked by a slug. Ooh, knocked out. Ooh. <laughs> Look at its head. Oh. Just when I'm using a physical attack. I see how it is. <laughs> oh! Even with reflect, bitch! Critical hit. I'll take it! Gastrodon, your services are no longer required for now. Off you go! To rest! Wow, I'll admit to being surprised by the outcome. Alright, next up... The Birdie! I'm going in the order that I caught the Pokemon in, except for Gastrodon, because it got better luck with these Pokemon trainers. I'll take it. Oh, 
we're almost there. Me lose to someone so young? I dare say not. Alright, old man, let's see what you got. Oh, he's not old at all, he just looked old. <laughs> Veteran Brian. His chibi form looked like an old man, what can I say? Alright, let's use Fly to do more damage. There you go. Fly, bird! Beat free! There you go. Nice. One down. Giraffe rig. I used to struggle a lot when I played against Giraffe rig in the second generation because it would look like a normal Pokemon. So. I would always forget that it's a psychic type Pokemon. And I would and then when I remember it's a psychic type Pokemon, I would then try to use Shadow Ball, and then I remember it's a normal type Pokemon. That doesn't work. <laughs> Gotta use dark type moves or a bug type move. It always, I don't know why, it always confused me because I did not see that Pokemon often. So when I had to fight it, I'll be like, what the hell do I use against you again? I could have used Aerial Ace actually, but you never know. Nacho is tanky. Fly is the insurance ability. Bye bye. Thank you, come again. Ooh! Close to 33. The power of youth. It's startling. Berries? Give me berries! Mm hmm. They really are. It was mainly the look. I'll be like, why doesn't this work? And then I try to use something else. Why does that not be super effective? Super effective. I don't get this. This sounds like a book block. Book block. And we are here! Oh, a Team Galactic member is over there. Doo -doo, doo -doo -doo -doo. Ooh. More berries and trainers to fight. Oh my goodness. We're gonna get very close to 36 to beat. What was her name again? Wait, 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 wait. It'll come back to me. Santina. If that is how you say her name, Fantina, Fantina, I'll call her Fantina. So we're gonna take care of these trainers as well on the route here to Mount Corone again. See how far we can make it, and then make it to our home. Let me talk to these people, see if they have any Pokemon moves or items for me. Hello! Welcome! What do you need? Oh! Pokeballs? And what do you sell? Yep! <laughs> She is French. I forgot she was French. Oh, this is the Pokemon shop. Wow. You don't have hyper potions? Um. Well. Uh, I can get some super repels. 
back to 20. Eh, I'll keep my hair proportions. Bye. Where are you from? Hmm, Twin Leaf Town, you say? Isn't that close to Lake Verity? That lake is said to be home to Mesprit, the being of emotion. It must be looking over you. How sweet! Oh yeah, one of my favorite songs too are the songs of those three legendary Pokemon. The song is so catchy and cool, I don't know why. My big sister is studying the myths of Sinnoh. She wants to know how people and Pokemon interacted in the days of myths. Were things different back then? Or were they the same as now? She says that's the focus of her, ser her research. Interesting. Howdy! Studying up on local history? Sure. Malkorone Tower is at the center of Sinnoh. In a way, it's the closest place to the sky in this region. You got anything for me? If I climb on top of Mount Coronet, will I be able to see all of Sinnoh? One way to find out. Oh, I felt that. Alright, let's heal and find the Elder. I gotta lean back. There you go. That's her. There's an. Oh, wait, no, that's not her. There is an odd spaceman in front of the ruins. There isn't anything there, but that only seems to make him get angry. He's saying he will blow the town up with a bomb. The nerve of it all! If only I were younger, I'd punish that spaceman with my Pokemon. Are you the elder? This town is insignificant. There's nothing of value here. It doesn't need to exist, so I'll blow it up with a galactic bomb. If you try to mess with me, I'll shut you down with a Pokemon battle. So what's it going to be? Are you going to mess with me? Yes! You dare to oppose Team Galactic? With me the first time. That means you're taking on the world. No, the universe even. Sure, buddy. Ooh, the night background is so cool. Ooh, he's not getting around. He has a butterfly. <laughs> Still weaker than me, though. How do you want to defeat me if you have a Pokemon that's seven levels lower than mine? I would like to know. I also love how when you battle the Galactic Commanders, the theme song has like a remix. It's so cool. Why am I hearing fireworks? Whoa! 33! Take down. Uh, I mean... I don't want you missing, but it would be nice to have a move that's not flying related, so why not? Aerial Ace is kind of weak right now, seeing how we're reaching level 40. I like how it does a little giggle. <laughs> Bye bye. 
even when it makes a sound, it sounds like it's giggling. <laughs> uh, I just got whooped over, and by a kid no less. Yep. Too much to handle. I can't do anything here. This place is nothing. I'll be happily rid of this place. Oh, you are magnificent! Aren't you quite the trainer? As the elder of Celestic Town, I give you my thanks. Oh, that old charm. May I see that, dear? What's that? You say Cynthia entrusted you with it to deliver to me? That's Cynthia. She's my granddaughter. This old charm is something made in Celestic Town long, long ago. It was made in honor of a mystical deity said to have created Sinnoh. These old charms are still discovered now and again. Since you're in Celestic Town, why not look around inside the ruins? I was just about to do that, thank you. Yep, it tells of the three. Mysterious designs cover a whole section of the wall. There are three strange things forming a triangle. In the middle of them, a shining sphere. What is this all about? The cave painting's meaning seems to be this. There existed a being. A being so powerful, it was considered a deity at the time. Opposing this powerful being were three Pokémon. The three kept balance with the being, as if they formed a triangle. It's an ancient legend of Sinnoh that is still told in Celestic Town. Oh yes, I found something useful. You should take this. It belongs to my granddaughter, but she doesn't use it anymore. Oh! Is it rock climb or surf? Surf. If a Pokemon learns surf, it can carry you across water and the sea. My granddaughter says something about this hidden move. Oh yes, to use surf outside of battle, the Heart Home Gym Badge must first be obtained. On that matter, you will have to handle it yourself, I'm afraid. Alright. So far, we're going exactly where we need to go in the order that we're supposed to go. So now, we've got surf. So I'm possibly going to get rid of Rain Dance or just get rid of Brine. Kind of sad about it, because... I mean, do I really need Rain Dance? I never have used it before. Brine can be used for any type of situation, because as long as the Pokémon is below a half health, it'll defeat it completely. It has its advantages. Uh, and I may actually learn something else where... I'll probably get rid of Rain Dance anyway. Like a Blizzard! I'm saving this for later. So, yep. Let's get rid of that attack. <laughs> For now, we're getting rid of Rain Dance. 95. Bye, Rain Dance. It was fun. Besides, if I need to boost my water type, po my water type moves, I could just get a Sea Incense and just equip it to Gastrodon. <laughs> so, yeah. Now, let me take a look to see if I can get that item that I was looking at. Uh, it wasn't that. It wasn't that either. Where did I get that? What? I don't... Wait a minute, was that a move? I think it was an attack move. <gasps> right! Trick Room was the move! The Pokémon gets to move first, if it's slow, for five turns. It's a Psychic-type move, only has five usage, so I have to use this during an emergency. Can Gastrodon learn this? Of course not. Wait! I can have Kadabra cast it and... Ah, oh, I'm sad now. I was so happy that I could give Gastrodon a little bit of a boost. 
Oh, there appears to have been an insignificant struggle here. Everyone should step back and view things from a bigger perspective. Yes, a bigger perspective. One that is on a universal scale. My name is Cyrus. I seek the power to create a new world. A world without strife. However, that power seems to be unavailable here. We've met before, yes? It was at Mount Coronet. I know, right? I'm sad. If you discover any power derived from the legends of Sinnoh, inform me. For that power is what I need to create my new world. Why would I tell you? Get out of here. I'll kick your ass later on, you'll see. Alright, I have yet to check this house. Before we go to meet those other trainers and then make our way. Oh look, it's a happy knee! Oh my god, it's so cute. I must bear down and train, but for that, time is unimportant. Therefore, I have no need for a watch. Take this from me. Wee! I get a watch! <laughs> nice! So now, aside from my party, I get a watch! <laughs> Woohoo! And back to my thing. Alright, let me do a quick check here. Everything is running good. Time flies. I have 33 minutes left. Eh, technically 42 minutes left. I started the stream early. Alright, let me try to get that gym badge by that time. I think I can. Hello! I go everywhere with my knocked owl. We're gonna show you owl best. Ha! Owl best. <laughs> it took me a bit. I'm like, wait a minute, what the fuck is that word? In the middle of that sentence. 31! Now we're talking. You're gonna give me 1k experience? Like a good little owl? Okay, don't miss. You had one job. <laughs> okay, we'll try it one more time. Now the thing is, Therivia is going to get a little bit of recoil damage. So, eh, it's like Brave Bird later on. But Brave Bird is so worth it. I like the sight of those feathers. <laughs> oh. My defense rose. That's cool. Metal feathers. Pew, pew, pew. Woo! 1k ish. Awesome. We did our best. That's what matters, right? Yes. I see you. Wait, I could just go this way. Hello. I'm strong. I'm strong. I'm... Am I really? Oh, wow. <laughs> no, I am strong. Okay, I'm all good to go. Are you serious? Whoa, you startled me good. I think you'll understand that I was doing what I was doing when you see this TM. Oh, uh, is it bulk up or something? Let me explain how that move works without getting too technical. Let's say your opponent raises its defense using Harden. Your Pokemon can use Psy up to get the same defense boost as its foe. Basically, your Pokemon gets the same status boost as its target. Wow. I need to heal my Pokemon. It's a very situational attack, and I don't like situational stuff. He turned. It's a big boulder, but a Pokemon may be able to push it aside. Oh, I thought it was something else. <laughs> 
Whilst exploring the ruins, I spotted a trainer. I must investigate. Airy would like to battle. Uh oh. Oh. Uh, well. Mm, my moves are not gonna work here. Normal won't work. Because it's steel. Steel won't work. Fly won't work. Wait, normal doesn't work, right? Eh. Oh. I could have Lux Ray finish this. Although maybe the dark type move will hit it as a normal type move. Because of the steel part. Oh, iron defense. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh, it flinched. Again. <laughs> Eventually, we'll take it down. Oh, God. <laughs> Okay, I've seen enough. I should have used Monferno. All the protection moves. Uh oh. You're you're fine. You, you can you can survive that. Yeah, there you go. It's not a cadaver. You're fine. It gets butt. <laughs> that animation is so funny. Oof. Beautiful. Well, I hope you guys are enjoying the stream so far. Love in the Pokemon journey. My investigation has revealed the trainer to be tough. Ouch. <laughs> Speed is a ninja's best weapon. Can you keep up? Pokemon. Oh, okay. Flying type moves should still work if fire type moves work on it. Speed rose. Interesting. Wow, it attacked twice. That was a an impressive boost. Again, oh, good, it actually used a different attack. Beautiful. This is what they all should do instead of confuse Ray. And supersonic. <laughs> Kick its ass. Nuisance of a Pokemon. <laughs> Get out of here. Alright. 34. Woohoo! I did a lot to conceal myself, too. I was gonna say, evolving. 
the final form. Okay, last I saw its attack was 68? Let's see how much it is now. Close combat! Of course, you're a bird, but you can kick ass! Alright, we're gonna be able to take down. Ninety... A hundred and twenty damage! But it loses defense and special defense. I am okay with it, because the battle would be over by that point. Bye, take down! Woohoo! My mighty bird! Now we're looking good! 102! Beautiful! Looking good. Now this one has low stats, but it's decent considering it's very tanky. This one's turn to evolve soon. <laughs> Alright. Luxray is next. I'm psyched for this. Here goes. I actually forgot for a minute there that it learns close combat. <laughs> okay, can't use bites. I'm gonna have to just use regular electric. Beautiful. Fucking love its attack. Woo! <laughs> Indeed, Renee. Quick road to level 33. Beautiful. One more level. I don't know- oh, I don't get why I can't win. <laughs> okay, let's see how far we can go. Strength. Pokeball. Yeah, I believe the, up, the upper part is for when we get to snow point. Okay, that's all we that's all we can do. <laughs> that's as far as we can go. Fun times. All right, to Hearth Home City, Jim. That's not Hearth Home. Whoops, <laughs> I flew here so many times. This is hard <laughs> Now, this city is a major, major lag spike. So I will try my best to run to the gym as fast as possible. I will probably use my bike because I can't walk in any part of the city 
because it's terrible. <laughs> so we're gonna speed through it. The funny thing is, Luxray has bite, so it's gonna get a nice couple of attacks going. Oh wait, I gotta get some hyper potions. What was the last town that gave me hyper potions? Astoria City. Doo -doo 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 -doo. I gotta refill back to 20. No, no, no! The reflexes. Okay, run. After this gym, we can surf everywhere. Exploration. What? <sighs> was it actually Valstone City? I think it was. It even had Max Repel. I mean, Max Potion. Run, run, run. This part is also tricky. Go, go, go. I have a good amount of money, I could take the opportunity to start purchasing Ultra Balls. Because we're gonna need a lot of them. 29. Uh, let's start with at least 15. I wanna have some money at least. Okay, we're good. We're good for a while. Even the music is struggling. Up. Oh. Go, 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 go. No breaks. No breaks. Okay. Oh boy. Hey there! How's it going, champ to be? The gym leader here is a user of ghost type Pokemon. Beware! Normal type moves have no effect at all on ghosts. It's as if they weren't there! But you have to see it for yourself. Go get him, Challenger! I believe in you. Well, thank you. Luxray will do just fine. Now, if I remember correctly, her strongest Pokemon is 36. Miss Mag Magius or something? <laughs> oh, right. Question. 3 plus 5 plus 7? What the fuck? I forgot it was quizzes, but I, I, I kind of want to fight. No, I'm fighting every trainer. I don't care. I need to level up. I don't want to be under level. If I can battle everybody, I will. Do -do -do -do. Don't you have a poke edge, or did you screw up deliberately? Ha! Ah, you catch on quick. <laughs> I want to battle every trainer in the gym, so I can have all the experience. I'm gonna need it. Fight that ghost! <gasps> you have more speed than me. How dare you! That's what you get. <laughs> oh, 
Hunter. One of my favorite Pokemon. <laughs> and then at some point, Luxray is going to learn Crunch, which is awesome. Beautiful. Wow, I was done in. Bye. <laughs> you threw the quiz so you'd get to battle me, right? Yes! It's like they know me. Ooh, Nisravus. How adorable! Go bite it! Nom nom! There you go. Asserting dominance. <laughs> Alright. Don't you know how to take it easy on anything? <laughs> no. You're in a gym. There's no taking it easy. <laughs> that sounded so funny to me, I don't know why. I'm not even gonna go... I'm not even gonna look. I've been to all sorts of places. That means I know tons of things. Pokemon. Oh wait, did I already turn 34? Oh, okay. Nom nom nom. Kadabra, your turn. Just for one level. <laughs> you should not have more, uh, less speed than Ghastly. Yeah! Beautiful. You ain't surviving that. Bye! The look of Shadow Ball in this game is epic. And Psybeam. <laughs> yeah, whatever, you can battle too. GG. Oh, wrong button. afraid of picnicking anywhere, so I've learned all sorts of things. Ooh, Drifloon! This super adorable squishy Pokemon. Ghost flying. Adorable. Have a shockwave. But very tanky when it evolves. Very tanky. <laughs> I 
A ghost Pokemon for sure that was pretty cool to me was from Pokemon Black and White, Chandelure. I was like, wow, they made a Pokemon out of you? And then later on, there's also a Pokemon that's literally ice cream. It's so cute. Vanillish. <laughs> Your toughness, it's something new to me. I found that so adorable. And then the other Pokemon surprised me. Trash. A Pokemon made out of trash. I forgot its name. <laughs> I just couldn't believe that they actually did that. <laughs> The fuck? <laughs> anyway, da -da 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 -da. this should be the last one, the last floor, and then it should be the, the leader. I study subjects like Pokemon and history. You know, all the important things. You guys sure like talking about important things. Thirty. Just enough to get me to thirty-four. Yeah. You're not surviving that. Kadabra's too strong. <laughs> if it was any other Pokemon, it would have survived. Kadabra's just nasty. Look at that special attack. Nasty. Psycho cut. Isn't that a physical move? Yep. The user tears the foe with blades formed by psychic power. It has high critical hit ratio. Well, if only you were uh, decent at normal attacks. But you're not. Next psychic type move I learn is psychic. Oh, what in the? I didn't study enough. Inferno can have a little bit of fun before we fight the gym leader. I've probably studied more about Pokemon than you. <laughs> Ooh, I can use Rock Tomb! Let's just hope it hits hard, because we have reached a point where the Rock Tomb may be a little weak now. It only does 40 damage. Yeah, if it was Drift Blim, it would have survived. Without even reaching half health. Perks of Unevolved Pokemon. Oh yeah, it explodes! Right, I forgot about that. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute! I didn't learn Flare Blitz yet! <laughs> oh, you feel bad. I'm ang oh, something, something. Angry. Okay, now I think we're gonna go against the gym leader. <laughs> what? One more? The first room's answer. <laughs> it was 15. Okay, this is the last one then. Seriously, kid. Why don't you answer the quiz properly? You could get to the gym leader without a problem. Waste of my time. Now I gotta knock you around a bit. Well, I mean, I'm sure you are not working at the gym just so people can skip you. That'll be boring. Instead, I'm gonna kick your ass. I 
bye. I knew it. <laughs> no! No hypnosis for you. Get out of here. I was happy with you. Don't annoy me. <laughs> Fucking hypnosis. 35. Beautiful. 79. Gengar! Ooh! Oh my god, it's adorable. Uh-oh. That's eh, fine. I'll do enough damage to take it down by that point. Bye-bye! Ooh! I kind of deserved that, didn't I? I gotta stop mouthing off like that. Yeah, you should. Bye now. Alright, the last official Pokemon trainer. Ooh, ooh, you want to battle me? Okay then, I'll do the best I can. She is so happy. <laughs> Starting off level 30, I like that. Oh. Oh! My point! <laughs> Don't do that. Took away four of my points. Uh oh, Driplim. <laughs> oh boy. Let's not fail Rock Tomb. I think I want to hit it with this first. Damn! Oh boy. It's defense rows and special defense. Aww. Uh oh. That hurts. I'm gonna have to heal before I kill it. Uh oh. Oh, okay. <laughs> I survived the aftermath. Ooh. Yay! 36! 81! Close combat, baby, let's go! Bye bye, match punch. I mean, five, but it's. Uh, I have to use it. 80 something, I'm gonna have to remember that. I squeezed out all of my power! You're an impressive challenger! Evolve! My precious ape. Eighty something, eighty eight, eighty nine attack, and now it's probably around a hundred as well, just like looks right. Woo! My monkey. One oh one. There you go. You have more attack than my... How dare you? <laughs> 104, 81, 101, 75. Wow. This Luxray is stronger than my Infernape. 
This is the first time my Luxray stats were stronger than my Infernape stats. Alright, Luxray, you're up. The level up timing was beautiful, because now Luxray is going to be used for the battle. Alright. No more elevators! Here we go! Almost exactly 16 hours of gameplay! To the 5th gym badge! <laughs> Oh, finally, you have arrived! Since I came to this country, always I try to learn new things. They hold contests in the city. I say to myself, in fin, I will excel. That is why I dress this way. Sust un performance. Also, I study Pokemon very much. I have come to be gem leader. And uh, so it shall be that you challenge me, but I shall win. That is what a gym leader does, non? Let me see if I'm right. That Miss Magius is 36. Fantina. She's French, so yeah. It has to be Fantina. Fantina. Hmm, both of these would work. But... You tanky bastard, I knew it. <laughs> it's fine, we're baiting her healing. Now, rather than later. I get to attack twice because of that. So, thank you very much. It's so tanky that the Hyper Potion didn't even finish healing it all the way. Wow. That's how tanky it is. <laughs> That's amazing. Ouch. Nice. Quick trip to level 36. Miss Magius is out. 36? <laughs> I remember correctly. Bite. Oh my god, you have more speed than Luxray. Uh oh, survive, survive, survive. Whew. Luxray is amazing, but special defense is not its best quality. Oh, we're both gonna use Hyper Potion at the same time. She's still gonna use it. I can't risk it. She is still gonna use it. Last time I got baited by that, so no thank you. Oh boy. I should have just attacked, but now I'm in trouble. Huh. I should have just. Well, actually. Huh. Oh boy. She's gonna keep using that. Okay. It doesn't matter. We're gonna have to leave this to Kadabra. She has more speed than me. This is gonna keep happening over and over and over. <laughs> so I have to reset it. Alright, see if you have more speed than my Kadabra, you bitch. I hope you don't. It'll be awkward. 
Oh my god, confuse Ray and it's awkward. <laughs> Cadabra, I'm gonna need you to not miss. Oh god, you have one job. Magical leaf. You could have used Shadow Ball. I appreciate it. Oh, good. Okay, we're good. Alright, what's the last Pokemon? I actually don't remember. <laughs> Woohoo! Share the experience. Gengar! I think Gengar might have more speed than me. 34. Oh, heavens, what is this? Is this my final Pokemon? Oh. Oh, yeah, it's a physical attack. Kadabra is squishy as well. Alright. I leave it to Gastrodon. Poor Gucci. Gengar is gonna be faster than me, though, but. Uh, oh! Oops. I'm gonna take the time to revive my Pokemon because I don't wanna deal with Confuse Ray when it's against the Gengar. And I use the wrong attack. And it landed! <laughs> uh, I'll risk dig. You are quite tanky, so... Aww. Yay! Twice now it snapped out of confusion the turn right after. That's awesome. Alright, you got this. You stop using that! Oh my god, I forgot about that. Gengar floats. Shit. Okay, fine. I actually forgot about that shit. <laughs> so. Never give up. Never surrender. She's gonna heal now, and so am I. Yeah. Oh no, my points. Shit. Eh, I think it should be fine as long as he doesn't spam that. Ooh, I can use Brian now to finish him off. I mean, her. Have fun. Uh oh. You suck. Come on, Gastrodon, show it who's boss. Oh. Brian will have to wait. Come on, snap out of it. Oh. The unnecessary stalling. Okay. I'll let it happen just for this to finish. It's kind of stalling. Jesus. Alright. Punch it, come on. Ooh, 
Luxray could have ended it all actually, but Miss Magius has more speed. Victory! You are so fantastically strong! I know now, blah blah blah, I couldn't read that, it was fast. I am dumbfounded! So very, very strong! You, your Pokémon, so strong! Your power is admirable! I shall honor it with this gym badge. Woohoo! Fifth gym badge! Two gym badges in one stream. Epic. That badge will let you use the hit and move surf outside of battle. Also, you can make use of this technical machine. That is what I think. Uh, which one is this? Shadow Claw. Ooh! A very startling move it is. It's hit turn critical often. Awesome. I wonder who can learn it. I think maybe Infern Ape can learn this. Critical hit move often. Yup. Good protection against psychic types. I'm learning it. I am getting rid of the fucking protection against flying types, because I can fucking beat their asses with flame wheel. And close combat. And Rock Tomb is getting low. 50. And it misses. Shadow Claw. Epic. These elevators are so slow. <laughs> Funny enough, the next gym has a lot of elevators. to see you. You're not very easy to track down. My grandma told me about what took place in Celestic Town. Thanks for what you did in the ruins. That Team Galactic. I thought they were just an eccentric bunch of freaks. You know, talking about how they're going to make a new universe and all. And that weird way they dress too. I thought they were harmless. It appears as if they're a lot more trouble than I thought. I mean, stealing and hoarding Pokemon. That's just plain wrong. By the way, did you find the ruins interesting at all? If you did, you may want to visit the library in Canalab City. Yep. They have some ancient books that you might find interesting. It may also be of help to the completion of your Pokedex. I think you ought to go there. Okay, bye bye for now. To the next gym. finished yeah pretty much right on time so now we can use surf which means I'm gonna be off screen exploring all the areas I've been to already and just use surf just explore finish training See where I'm gonna have to fly to first. I think I have to go back to my old town, yeah. Iron Island. 
Yep, we're gonna have to go to Jubilife. The less leggier areas. Basically, we just gotta go here and we find the city. So yeah, I'll basically, if I get the chance to, I'll be doing that off screen or I'll just randomly take care of that at some point. But I do want to check out the other areas because you never know. Sometimes you find Pokemon trainers that you gotta fight um, outside of the area when you're surfing and stuff. So yeah, we're gonna leave it here. I've gone a little over my time, 2 hours and 16 minutes, but it was pretty good, so thanks for everybody who was able to stop by, I hope you guys enjoyed the stream, and hopefully it was behaving, and you know, pretty much just not being that laggy. I'll basically be uploading this on my YouTube right after and yeah if tomorrow everything goes as planned I should be able to stream some more GTA San Andreas we're gonna be continuing the territory takeover because I really need to get that done so I'm gonna have to just continue trying to take over territories once that's done I'll be safe no one during missions are gonna just randomly try to take over my territory and all that stuff so I'll be able to continue this the actual story mode in peace so I'll be taking care of that if I manage to get to stream tomorrow so thanks to everybody that was able to stop by I hope you guys enjoyed the stream and I'll see you next time take care be safe and stay healthy